I did not care if people were cured of being a drug addict unless they were social, socially aware. So I made them socially aware and then I work on them. Because if a guy stops drinking, so what does he do now? Nothing. He just does nothing. So I want him to be a useful person in the world. So I would help those. So I worked on many, many alcoholics first. So they started <coughs> their own section of Alcoholics Anonymous. You know what that group is? The group of alcoholics that say, I turn myself over to God and with his help I will stop drinking and all that. So this group, I took their gods away and said, if you want a better world, you got to get up off your ass and make it better. If you want a telephone, you have to invent it. If you want your children to be saner, you have to make them saner through education, you know. So they like that. So they started their own alcoholic group called the 105 group. On page 105 of the book Alcoholics Anonymous, it says, may any, every person conceive of God in their own way or no way, but as long as they practice you know, this concept of being free to think of God in any way or no way, not fixed, not rigid. So they started 105 group because page 105 said that. But the other alcoholics that believe in God used to trample the 105 group, you understand, due to their conditioning background. The 105 group grew very fast and they read books on science and technology, didn't invent their own answers. They learned how to say the most difficult words, I don't know. Once you say, where did all this come from if there's no God? I don't know. But the Bible says, some guy called God made a man and a woman in a beautiful garden. And then he made a snake that tempted them. The snake walked upright, according to the Bible. And because the snake tempted them, God disliked that so much he made the snake crawl on its belly. That's why snakes crawl on their belly. Snakes can move very freely through the grass. And their horses sleep standing up. Did you know that? All right. So the Bible says the reason is one saint asked the horse to take him across the river. That was shallow. And the horse said, no. He said, from now on you're not going to sleep lying down. You have to sleep standing up. I don't like it. That's crap. It's no good. <laughs> You know what I mean? Yeah. It's too low grade for me. <clears throat> so I don't accept it. But if the Bible appeared that God had a different concept, you know, I might have accepted it. But I've never found the concept. Yes.